In this video we're going to show you the basic way of ripping a DVD to a hard drive using the program Handbrake. Handbrake is in our dock here. We're going to go ahead and start that and by default you will get the source dialog box that opens up. So we simply need to navigate to where the DVD is. So I'll select the DVD here in this case and you'll see the DVD structure of the folders listed here. I'll click on open and what Handbrake will do next is actually scan the DVD. It's looking for the different video files essentially on the DVD. So it's going to scan that source and look for the different titles associated with the DVD. So it found 23 of them and it's scanning all of them. So it'll take a few seconds to finish that but when it's done in this title drop down menu you'll see all the video files essentially that it found on the DVD. One of them will be the main movie title and that's the one that generally we're going to want to rip or to uh, encode from the DVD to our hard drive. So we'll give it a few more seconds here but we should see eventually 23 titles that have been scanned and our destination in this case is going to be the desktop when all these titles are loaded in. So in just a couple of seconds we should see our title appear and here's our main movie. It's two hours and 30 seconds long. If we click this drop down menu you'll see all the other titles that it found of varying lengths and sizes. Um, this main one though is, is the main movie title and these others are just basically special features that are on the DVD. So we're going to save this file or encode this file to our desktop in this case. Uh, we're going to save it as a as an M4V or in in the background actually it's an H.264 MPEG4 file that's going to be saved to our desktop. The other thing that we need to do is we need to select a profile or a preset. Um, if you don't see the presets window here, there's a little toggle button. So if you click this again, it'll open back up and normal, the normal profile under the regular uh, preset is what we're going to choose. There are other devices, other device settings that you can choose such as iPhone 4 or iPad, the original Apple TV, the Apple TV 2 and so on. If you want to get that specific you can but in this case the normal profile will be a good default setting for us to use. So if we've got all our settings the way that we want them, we have our main movie title selected, we have our destination selected, we can simply click on the start button that will start the process of reading that main movie file and again it's just going to do a quick scan to see if everything is where it's supposed to be and it will start to encode the movie and after a few seconds you'll see the frame per second this will actually finish fairly quickly on this particular computer uh, generally less than an hour for for this particular movie um, it can take longer or shorter depending on the movie or just depending on how fast your computer is so after about 45 minutes or so, give or take, this will be done and a file on our computer. So that's how you rip a movie from a DVD onto your hard drive using the program Handbrake. Hope you enjoyed this and thanks for watching.